How's it going, ladies and gentlemen? I'm Paul Nurk Nurkula, and uh, today we are joined by the United States Air Force for the United States Air Force DRL Flight School. Um, and I've got my special guest. My name is uh, Senior Ms. Stubblefield, the United States Air Force, or uh, Stubbs is my main in-game handle. So we are going to check out the new U.S. Air Force Boneyard map, so we're just going to jump into it. All right, let's, let's do it. So yeah, as we're going around, what are you, what are you seeing here, uh, stuff? I'm seeing a, a lot <laughs> and a lot of aircraft. I and mean, I know this is uh, what we what we call the Bowen Yard in Davis Mountain Air Force Base over in Arizona. We all call it DM. And where are you stationed now? Uh, right now, I am uh, at RAF Lake Heath in the United Kingdom. Okay. And what role do you have in the Air Force? So my job is a uh, 3PO, or uh, most commonly known as Security Forces. Anything on the based on the installation. We provide security for and uh if anything goes wrong that's when uh our job comes in so i think one of the best crossovers that we have here between the uh the drone racing league and the air force is that we we both have a uh, investment in gaming can you tell me a little bit about that yeah so we uh are creating what we call air force gaming so if uh if you play a lot of video games you you meet up with another airman and say hey we have something in common let's friend each other and let's just start playing on our off days and, the, and that social aspect is super important I, and, I, mm -hmm. and that's, that's one of the things that i love the most about drone racing everybody that f has flown a drone or especially like a drone like this is like you've you've gone through some stuff right like you've broken it you've crashed it you've had to fix it all this stuff and like exactly. and what happens when you bring a bunch of people together that have done that it allows you to bond uh you know regardless of your language or race or background and that's one of the exactly like, yep same with the air force one of my best friends I met him in uh, in basic military training BMT. We're, we're still friends to this day. He's uh, he's currently deployed right now, but we, but we text whenever we can. We we get on and we play Call of Duty with each other whenever we can. That's so amazing. Like, I made a best friend in the Air Force, not even being a, a month in, because of video games. Yep. And we would have we would have never met unless it was for the Air Force. Uh, so you want to just do like a quick like a 101 sort of course thing? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that'll work. That's a really fancy controller right <laughs> this is what i'm working with right here so well so like the the beauty of this over like a console controller is mm -hmm. that there's a lot more granularity to the sticks so like the throw is a, a much higher range so mm -hmm. you get a little bit more precise um so on the right stick here you can see it moving back and forth and it controls mm -hmm. the roll axis and then pitch is front and back on the right stick um and then on the left stick you've got throttle which again holds the position so you don't have to keep fiddling with it mm -hmm. um and then you also have yaw so that's your your rudder essentially um and uh that is that's really all the controls that you need to control the drone but it's this kind of uh orchestra with each other if i want to turn left it's not just turn the stick left right because now it's like flying that, was, that was that was my problem you've got to kind of find that balance of so when i turn left i'm actually moving both sticks it's a coordinated turn Oh, uh, see, and then, I wish I would have known that for the 14 minutes that I played. <laughs> yeah. So thanks, everybody, for joining us for this episode of the U.S. Air Force uh, DRL Flight School. Thanks very much, uh, Airman Stubblefield, for joining us. Uh, it's been awesome to be able to talk to you about all of your experience in the Air Force. It's been a pleasure to get to know you. Oh, yeah. It, it's it's been amazing. Great to meet you, too. And just watching you fly is like, oh, I want to play this now. It's, it's like it, it's the Vulcan or something inside of me. It's just it's amazing. <laughs> Good. Awesome. Well, uh, join us for the rest of the series. Uh, we got a bunch more episodes. It's going to be kind of 201 level, like learning how to fly drones. Um, I'm going to kind of go through a bunch of different maneuvers and processes and all that kind of stuff. It's going to be awesome. Thanks very much uh, for hanging out, and be sure to aim high. <laughs>